So uh, one thing that you should keep in mind that human also make transfer for learning. So how, how human makes that? I mean, if you, if you make a, if you think metaphorically, if you're trying to make a kind of a, a analogy with human, uh, humans see a dog. You see a dog. So you see a dog. But how can you identify the dog? Generally, you, you, your brain is going to take a kind of cup of, of feature from that dog. Such as the dog can bark, the dog has four paws, the dog has uh, tails, fur, and so on. That's how your model is able to make a stack of features, a feature stack. Uh, whenever you see another dog, even though the, the dog is a little bit different, you are still able to identify the dog because they have the same kind of feature. But if by any chance you have a dog that looks like a cat, for example, I have seen some cat that look like a dog. So your brain is getting a bit confused. You, you don't know what's that. I mean, that does not have the feature of a dog. Always keep in mind that the fact that you are able to identify a dog very fast is because you memorized the dog, somehow the feature. But uh, if, if I show to you a dog that has a little bit, a little bit different, for example, you go to a very a country that has very wide species that was not extinct, you may find a dog that's not like a dog. Sometimes you see this kind of picture of animals that are very exotic, uh, such, as, such as a bird that has uh, some kind of animal that, that has a, a beak of a bird. Then you, you just say, what animal is that? Because your brain is still a little bit confused. I mean, you, your brain does not have this kind of feature structure for a, a a bigger data set. I mean, data set for human can be like four or five and ten. We are very good at feature extraction, so we do not need to generate a very big data set to learn. So uh, as I was walking uh, walking around one time, I saw a, 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 a child say to an adult, like he was his dad. He said, like he look, dad, that's a chicken. That wasn't a chicken. That was a dove. And uh, the, the adult was laughing a lot. I mean, I, I, I didn't laugh because I, since I studied machine learning, I know that it's possible. So a machine is going to make similar mistake. The child made the mistake because the child still learned how to make, to make feature extractor. The, the child is still not able to uh, identify precisely. Because, but, but you see uh, the, the dove and the chicken, they're more or less the same. They, they, they fly, they have wings, they have to uh, pose or whatever, I don't know how to call it, for a, for a bird, they have a beak. So uh, the difference is how this, the noise they make, uh, uh, how they walk, uh, this one cannot fly, some kind of a tail here, but that takes a while for us to learn how this feature. So it's normal for a child to in the beginning. A child is like a machine learning model that has not well be trained yet, they're still being trained. Human take years to be trained. Machine learning can be taken seconds. So that's one of the big difference. So uh, for me, it was not fun. I mean, it was curious, but not fun that child made a mistake because I think uh, if, if you are familiar with machine learning, they also can make very stupid mistakes. I One time I was training machine learning, it, it, it misplaced uh, a, a, a backpack with a bulletproof vest. Uh, I mean, it's like similar if you look on the image. 